I recently had a DEXA scan to check the mineral density of my bones. I would have also liked to check my visceral fat percentage, not the subcutaneous one. Visceral fat is way more important to have it as low as possible. However, I don't have this option in my city. Additionally, I would have also liked to check my pure muscle mass percentage. Also not an option for me in my city. However, if you can undergo such tests, and especially if you're over 40 years old, I strongly recommend you do that. However, I was able to scan the lumbar area because bone composition degradation is most quickly visible there. If that area is healthy, it can be inferred that the rest of the bones are at least equally healthy. For those who are new to my channel, I primarily practice calisthenics, focusing mainly on fundamental exercises, the basics. Since bone mineral density tends to decrease over time, I consider it relevant to know how strong and healthy my bones are and to understand if I am at risk of future bone diseases. Some of the diseases associated with deteriorating bone health include osteoporosis, osteopenia and osteoarthritis. Of course, I am interested in finding out if the physical training I do works for bone mineral density because, as you probably already know, strength training has the most beneficial impact on strengthening bones. However, I generally practice resistance training using my own body weight, so theoretically falls into the strength training category, but not entirely. It depends on many factors. Doing sets of 20 push-ups and 10 pull-ups, for instance, plus squats and hill sprints, I wouldn't necessarily expect it to sufficiently influence the skeletal system, but it turns out that it does, for me at least. My bones are in very good condition with low risk of deterioration over time, Theoretically, I should have healthy bones even at the age of 80. Therefore, all I need is to continue being consistent with my workouts and remain dedicated because I want to maintain the health of my bones and the current functionality of my body. Regarding nutrition, it probably goes without saying that I have a very the non-restrictive diet, but I eat quite healthily, so to speak. Recent blood tests indicated I have very good level of minerals in my blood, including reserves, my diet includes almost daily consumption of whole dairy products, nuts, seeds, various types of meats, vegetables, fruits and starchy vegetables, so balanced and varied. Well, I hope this video is informational to you, let me know what you think, and again, I strongly recommend you do the DEXA scan. Thanks a lot for watching, if you're interested in training programs, you can go on my website. Bye.